Well, right now, many Americans are dealing with financial hardships, and a change provided by the CARES Act allows people to tap into their 401ks early. Scripps reporter Alicia Nieves looks at what you need to consider before you make this move. When Congress passed the CARES Act, it approved billions of dollars in direct stimulus checks, billions more in business loans, but it also approved a provision that would allow people to tap into their retirement fund penalty free. The important thing for the CARES Act is it, it gave Americans some additional options. It gave employers some additional ways to help their workforce get through this tough time. Nevin Adams is with the plan sponsor Council of America, a nonprofit trade association that surveyed 401k plan sponsors after the CARES Act was passed. PSCA found that less than half of plan sponsors were moving forward with implementing the legislative change, though some were still deciding. It's important to note that while Congress passed the provision, plan sponsors had the option to implement it or not. The larger you were as a plan sponsor, as an employer, the more likely you were to have decided already that you were going to take some action. And in the most part, those who decided to take an action were in fact adding these new distribution and loan options. What were some of the reasons behind why some sponsors, plan sponsors, didn't want to implement this legislation? They're concerned about uh, giving people all this ready access to that retirement savings money a little too soon and, and wanting them to take advantage of other options as they've got them available. And I think there's also a concern if you think about what's going on in the markets that for participants to be rushing in and pulling money out of that retirement savings at this particular point in time, they would they would impose, they would take that loss. One of the fundamentals of investing is buying low and selling high. Right now, pulling from your retirement fund would be doing the opposite of that. But for some, it has been necessary. The good news is at a high level, even though there has been an increase in those volumes anecdotally, um, People are not going crazy about it, and I think that's a I think that's a very good sign. Most financial advisors say you really should avoid tapping into your 401k even right now unless you absolutely have to. If you do and your plan sponsor allows for it, here's what you need to know. The 10% penalty is waived. You still have to pay taxes though, but those taxes can be spread over the next three years. And there is a cap at about a hundred thousand dollars. I'm Elisa Nieves reporting.